Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Barbie Sacks, the big one, not the little one. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you guys so much for coming back. If you are new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, baby, so you can join the fam because we live over here and that's all, period, okay? All right, guys, so as you can tell by the title, today's video is going to be a day in my life as a nail tech. Yes, I am a stripper, but I am also a nail tech, okay, baby? Don't get it confused. A girl is a jack of all trades, baby. I think that's how they say it, right? <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, so your girl work at the nail salon. If you haven't watched my previous vlog, um i just got a job at the nail salon like a month ago or whatever so your girl kind of just been trying to get adjusted and how everything worked you know what i'm saying the flow this that, and the third so i decided why don't i take y'all to the nail salon with me why don't i take y'all to the nail salon with me so y'all can see how i get down you know what i'm saying so that's what we're gonna do today y'all but first and foremost y'all let me show y'all my hair yeah your girl really laid dead yeah <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah your girl really laid that baby and that's all period y'all so i just woke up or whatever not too long ago um i already brushed my teeth i already washed my face i did my hair uh right before i came on camera or whatever so your girl looking really really slay really really laid y'all look at them baby hairs baby who don't play with your girl do not play with your girl. all right y'all so um i'm about to uh put some clothes on we got like two things to do before we go to work um, I gotta stop at the post office, y'all, and I have to send off a money order, and I have to go get me some food before we gotta go to work, baby. So right now it is eleven eleven. Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> so right now it's eleven eleven, y'all, and um, I go to work at one o'clock, so we got two hours to get ready to go to work, or whatever. which is a lot of time, honestly, because the post office is right there, and I'm think I'm gonna just go like Chick Fil A or something to go get some food to eat. You know, some slide, nothing too heavy or whatever. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Um, I need to figure out what I'm gonna wear to be honest, because your girl don't know. Your girl don't know what she gonna put on. I don't know. When I like when I go to work, I like to be comfortable, y'all. I like to put on like sweats, a t shirt, you know what I'm saying? No makeup. Just like to be real, real chill, y'all. So the outfit of the day gonna be real, real chill. Don't look for nothing crazy because I ain't doing it. Okay. Today's Friday, September the 16th, y'all. Time to make that money. It's time to make that money, baby. You already know. If y'all don't know, baby, y'all should know by now. And if you new here, baby, I'm gonna say it for you. Over here, we get money. <laughs> All right? Over here, baby, we get money. This channel is just strictly about money, baby. That's it. That's all. Uh, money and straight vibes, baby. So let's get it. Like I said, I like to be really, really comfortable, y'all. I don't like to wear nothing too tight. You know what I'm saying? Your girl like everything to be comfortable. Period. All right, so let's go. Okay, guys, so this is what your girl is wearing to work today. I got my hand in this ponytail, you know what I'm saying? I got this blue fila shirt on. I got my tights on, and I got my sneakers on. These sneakers is from Steve Madden. Super freaking cute. Oh, whatever, and comfortable. So this is what we're going to wear, y'all. Like I said, I like to be comfortable. Your girl ain't trying to be doing too much at the nail salon, all right? I'm there to do nails, baby, and it's dead, all right? Period. All right, y'all, so... Let's run these errands right quick so your girl can um hurry up and go to work, y'all. I gotta get me some food and I have to go to the post office. So let's go. You're welcome. You too. So I am just now leaving the post office, y'all. When I say that shit is so really freaking irritating, like they really be taking their sweet time just to assist you. Like, girl, I got stuff to do like can you hurry up I'm slightly irritated because like i really be feeling like the people in the post office like they usually people that work at the post office they usually be older people i mean sometimes you might see young people in there but usually they be having older people in there and i feel like the older people in there they be having attitude um i need y'all to check yourselves before y'all wreck yourselves for real because y'all really be doing too much you feel what i'm saying to the front desk because i was called next so when i got up there um i told the lady yeah i need a money order for da 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 whatever and so she printed out my 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 money order and stuff so then i had asked her because i was mailing it out too so i asked her, i was like um i put my information right here and the information right there and she was like you never sent out a letter before who is you playing with who is you playing with girl i was like no actually i haven't this is my first time how, how do you do it how do you do it like don't play with me like this your first time sending a letter out yeah it is it is what about it like stop playing with me like they really be acting miserable and if y'all are miserable that's fine but don't 
push off that bad energy onto the next person because you're miserable. If you're miserable, then leave. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody make you come to the post office every single day. Get another job. I don't know. Try McDonald's. They have an attitude with me. I didn't do nothing to you. Like, but I'm in a good mood, so I'm not gonna let nobody, you know what I'm saying, shift my mood and make me have a bad attitude because they have a bad attitude. So you can keep that. Anyways, y'all. So I'm on my way to Chick-fil-A to get me some food, y'all. I am freaking starving. I'm actually happy that I um I'm happy that I did the post office thing first because they about to go on lunch, I think at 12. So if I would have did it the other way around, I would have missed them. So I'm happy I did do that first. But I'm going to go to Chick-fil-A, y'all. Your girl is starving, okay? So, like, I was honestly, like, thinking, like, a couple days ago about, like, if I wanted to stay here or if I wanted to relocate, you know what I'm saying? I was also thinking about moving, y'all. Like, if I should move and just go to a bigger city, you know what I'm saying? Because I feel like where I'm at now, it's not that many opportunities. It's not that much going on, y'all. So I was honestly thinking about moving. And I don't really know if it's, you know if i should do it or not but honestly lately i just been feeling like i need a new scenery you know what i'm saying definitely not a yes and it's definitely not a no but it's kind of in the air y'all so let me tell y'all the places that i was considering going to okay i was thinking about going to atlanta i was thinking about going somewhere close to miami i don't know if i want to be in miami but i was thinking about going somewhere close to miami or i was thinking about going uh, to Jersey to be closer to my family. I don't know y'all, I just feel like I'm ready to see something different. Like I wanna see something different. And Jersey is definitely, definitely not something different, but it's just, to, it's just to be closer to family or whatever. But then again, I don't really know if I really wanna even do that. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, Atlanta, somewhere close to Miami, either Jersey, oh, or like Houston. Houston or Dallas, one of the two. But those is definitely my options, y'all. So yeah. that's definitely within the next year or two. Maybe not even two, maybe year span of moving. We'll see, y'all. We will see. If I have any subscribers out there that watch my videos that live in um, the areas Atlanta, Florida, Dallas. I mean, Atlanta, Florida, Texas. Well, not so much Jersey. I don't really care about Jersey like that. But Atlanta, Texas, or Florida, Hit me up, y'all. Hit me up on the gram. My Instagram name is Barbie underscore stacks with two Z's and two E's, y'all. I'm gonna insert it like right here. I'm gonna also insert like a picture of my page. Hit me up on it, gram, y'all, because I really need to know like how the club life is out there. I need to know like how the city life is out there, the entertainment life. I need to know how all that is out there because I'm really big on that. I'm really big on the club life, the entertainment life, and also just, you know, the vibes. Like that's definitely important to me, y'all. So please, if y'all are in that area, hit me up on the gram, hit me up, DM me. Let me know how y'all city is because your girl is definitely thinking about moving out there. But before I move out there, I'm definitely, I'm definitely, definitely going to damn that word is mad hard to say i'm definitely going to um uh, visit out there and just you know see side see and because at the end of the day like just because like the vibe feels right for you that doesn't mean the vibe might feel right for me you know what i'm saying so i just want people's um opinions on how they feel about their city you know what i'm saying and i want to go out there and visit and see how i feel about the city the vibes you know what i'm saying if the vibes feel right then i'm all i'm all in baby i'm all about vibes babe i'm all about good vibes y'all so the the vibes are good within the next year or two i'm definitely gonna be out there you know what i'm saying so i'm excited about that y'all so just stay tuned just stay tuned for everything that's coming because your girl got a lot in the works your girl got a lot in the works baby a lot in the works today is my last work day of the week y'all where i work at at the nail salon i get paid every week y'all um which is actually really really good because i always see money coming in you know what i'm saying from the club from the nail salon video before I get off work or when I get off work, I'm gonna show y'all my paycheck and everything. Yes, your girl is really letting y'all in. Your girl is really letting y'all in personally and letting y'all know how much she made for the end of the video. So make sure y'all stick around for that. Like don't just hop around the video, baby. Watch the whole video, okay?
Okay, y'all, so it is the end of the freaking day, and your girl is really freaking tired and i'm really ready to go right, so so far i've had about what one two three four four people and right now it's six o'clock your girl is ready to go i'm freaking sleepy whatever even though we going from one job to the next y'all already know how i go and right now i'm just about to clean up y'all and then wait till i get my paycheck and hit the dough period i am finally off work and i am so freaking happy okay i'm so freaking happy because y'all they was really up and there working your girl. You feel what I'm saying? Really up and there working your girl and your girl is a sleepy and girl ready to get home, eat, chill out until I gotta go to the strip club, okay? Period. But I'm going to show y'all my paycheck. Like I said in the beginning of the video, I'm gonna show y'all my paycheck to show y'all what I made for the week. Mind y'all, I did not work Monday. So I only worked Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, which is four days. And on top of that, Wednesday, I think it was, like I only took one person so this check right here is really really short but I'm gonna show you anyway to show you what I made for the week so my paycheck for the week was $268 okay $268 is what I made this week like I said I did not work Monday which I wish I did because my check is short as hell say y'all get paid by commission i get paid by the people that come in there i don't get paid by the hour so i really be depending on people to come in there like the people that come in there be depending on my paycheck honestly so yeah that's just how it works y'all this is gonna conclude the end of the video thank you guys so much for watching my video if you are new here y'all do not forget to hit that subscribe button baby subscribe to the fam because we love hearing that song period and if you are a returning subscriber thank you guys so much for coming back and watching another video i love you guys so much i hope you guys enjoyed this video because this video is very very different my channel is strictly on stripping and you know making money and things like that and that nature and this video is like totally different like i know y'all gonna be like what yeah it's different <laughs> but i appreciate you guys so much for watching my channel um like i said y'all i am not only a stripper i am a nail tech as well on the comment section if y'all like videos like this if y'all liked it if y'all like today's video let me know because if so i would definitely make more videos like this and i love you guys so much and i'll see y'all in the next one Mwah. <laughs>